Hi, thanks for stopping by Nuggle Mama's Handful. Today I thought I'd do something a little bit different. I'm going to be participating in a dialect blog haul with Mama Dweeb. I'll leave the link up there on the button so that you can check out all the other blogs participating. Um, kind of interesting because I am an Albertan living in Quebec, so I've picked up a bit of the, the French accent apparently, uh, even though I'm not French. So it should be fun. Let's see which words she has for us and sentences. Okay, so the words are pillow, exhausted, governor, entrepreneurial, calm, Milwaukee, Wisconsin, bagel, ambulance, aqua, femoral, 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 address, rural, and hypocrisy. Now the sentences are, <laughs> make me laugh, what do you call a store where you buy alcohol? It's a liquor store. And the second question is, what do you call it when you blow on a baby's tummy and make them laugh? That's a raspberry or a belly fart. Um, what do you call batting your eyelashes on someone's cheek? Those are butterfly kisses. Uh, fourth question is, what is another way of saying to deceive or swindle? To hustle? I don't know, that one, uh, to deceive or swindle. Yeah, I don't know. That one, I don't know. To hustle is what comes to mind, but I don't think it's the commonly used term in Canada or here, anyhow. Um, what is a funny way to say someone's not smart? One fry short of a Happy Meal um, is the example she gave. One uh, few cards short of a deck or not playing with a full deck of cards. Um, a few bricks short of a load is another one. Um, I can't think of any more right now. Uh, another name for butt. Um, Bum, derriere, tuchus. <laughs> That's what I got from my friend. We call it a tuchus a lot around here. Um, rear end, uh, badunk dunk, junk in the trunk. Um, although tuchus is probably the most commonly used one around our house. I'm gonna tap your tuchus and chase the kids around the house. Yeah, it's a fun game. Um, what do you call it when you drive through mud? Lots of it, often fast, and pray you don't get stuck. Well, that's mud bogging, isn't it? I've never partaken of mud bogging myself, but uh, I hear lots of the country folk like doing it, and some city folk too. Anywho, so that's it. That's my entry into this week's, or this month's, or whatever it is, um, dialect vlog hop. I hope you enjoyed it. I'd love to see the way you say certain things. Everybody says things so differently all around the world, so it's kind of fun. My husband was teasing me the other night because he said that I said nuclear the way that President Bush did, which if I think about it, I don't say it the way he said it. But when I'm not really thinking and I'm just speaking really fast, then I do tend to say nuclear, which is not the right way to say it. <laughs> Anywho, uh, have a fantastic weekend. Thanks for stopping by, and uh, we'll see you next week. Bye.